Good morning. Workout time. Yep. So we're going to go to the gym here on the 10th floor. Oops, or the 11th floor. Still can't figure this thing out to sit out. So huge. There's so much to see. We always take the stairs. We haven't taken the elevator. Not right? once. Good morning. So anyway, we are at the gym and working out first thing in the morning. And the first thing we do are abs. And why do we do that? That's to get all the blood flow in your core. That's the first thing you should do before you work out. Stretching and core. And at this gym, they have everything you could possibly ever want. And more. And those shoes. Yeah, you gotta grab a hold of those. Okay, put my weight. Right. Yeah. Bring your whole body full with your chin squeezing at the end range, getting a nice stretch on the way up. Yep. Yeah. Breathing as breathe in when you go up, blow out when you bring the machine and yourself down. doing this other exercise. This is for the lower abs. This is a machine that we don't have at our gym. It's got these handles that kind of bend, flex, and it isolates, I guess, the chest. Yeah, chest. The key about this machine and the beauty of it is the way it glides. And if you let it all the way back, you're gonna get a massive stretch. It's starting from the bottom versus the other machines in the gym usually are on the upper 
apart so you're getting a lot of your lower packs mid packs and even upper packs with a nice smooth blowing motion Yeah, it's like from the from the bottom actually. So you get more a better stretch without putting so much strain on your shoulders and other ones. So what I notice about all this equipment is that it's very isolating. All these machines. They're like compared to the stuff that we have in in our little town of Fort Lauderdale. So I'm sure they take a beating. The machines, yeah. That's how they put that other one. Lateral raises and eventually gets the side of your shoulder. You do this with three weights, but you can isolate it more. The machines. She just takes a way to guess for it. it makes it easier for somebody who doesn't have a strong core develop. Right? Shoulder has several muscles. This works the lateral deltoid. Like I said, machine just makes it easier. It doesn't incorporate a compound movement. And this does, I suppose, triceps, right? Biceps. You raise up the uh, C. It does is create a great stretch. The bicep is also one of those muscles with three different heads. Getting the medial head on this one. Oh, no. Yeah. She really, you know, isolates. A lot of people when they use free weights don't know what they're doing. So this is a uh, great training for dummies. <laughs> and in the position. In a good position. Yeah, because when you go on bands, I don't know what to do. So you see take the guest work out. Feel the burn? Yeah. By the pads being where they are, that also creates more isolation. So the person learns how to create that isolation on their own without the machine.
one to triceps. And another machine that isolates extremely well. The compound movement to this exercise would be, um, uh, how do you call it? Oh, I can't think of the name of it now. Almost like a push up, but you're actually doing uh, with the machine. No, not burpee. Push down, so I'll actually call it. Dips. The key with this one is to get the nice stretch at the end. The boards and the tricep muscle. Stretch, squeeze, stretch, squeeze. Thank you. 